Hey, it's Rich, the Louisiana Hobby Guy. And I've been noticing something on the forums lately, well, forever really, is that people say I upgraded from version 1.6 of Lightburn to 1.6.01 and I lost all of my settings. Well, that's not really true. <laughs> uh, yeah, your settings may have changed. There is a, a bug in Windows, and it's not in Lightburn in Windows um, that prevents your settings from rolling over to the new version occasionally to some people. Um, it hasn't happened to me yet, but apparently it happens to a lot of people because I've been seeing this all over Facebook and especially with this new 1.6.01 update. And uh, I just wanted to show you today how to fix that in three clicks. So uh, real easy, real short video today. <laughs> Uh, uh, which is not usual for me, but this one will be really short, I promise you. So let's jump over into Lightburn and let's take a look and see what we got. So uh, I've just upgraded to 1.6.01, .01, or I'm pretending that I have, and I've lost all of my settings. So what do we do from here? It's very, very simple. Up at the file menu, way up on top, there's one click, file. And here's the, the second click. We're going to come down here to Preferences, and we're going to click on Load Prefs Backup. Now, I just did a video on this not long ago. If you search my channel for disaster, I've got a lot more information in that video. But we're just going to make our second click now on Load Prefs Backup. And here we go. So take a look here and see. Today's date is June 17th, 2024. The last backup was made at 2.15 p.m. And uh, it backs up quite frequently when you're using it. This is all today, right here. But let's say that um, you upgraded today. So just to be careful, all you have to do, uh oh, this is gonna be four clicks, okay. <laughs> all you have to do is come to June 15th just to be safe, just the first one in June 15th and just click load and that's it and you're done all of your preferences in lightburn will be completely restored once you click that load button now i'm not going to click it now because i already uh I, I don't have to i have all of my settings and i some of the settings have changed and i don't want to revert to those so uh, that's all you have to do is find a date here and if it was last week you know when you're we can go all the way back let's see how far this machine goes back I can go all the way back to April 30th of this year. So uh, over two months worth of settings are in, in this device and I can go back to any one that I want and all I have to do is click load and that is the end of the problem. Everything will be completely restored the way it was before you upgraded. And one of the uh, crazy things that I see online is people trying to diagnose the problem themselves. And I understand why you want to do that. You want to get your settings back. Uh, you know, and I hear I uninstalled Lightburn. Don't do that. <laughs> Watch my disaster recovery video. Uh, they're saying that I reverted to, you know, version 1.5 that did work and I still don't have my settings back. Well, there's nothing that you're going to do, nothing you'll be able to do without loading a previous version of your preferences so and that will reload all of your settings and it doesn't matter I, I, the extremes that some people go to they spend hours trying to figure this out rather than going to lightburn's website or you know uh, even searching for something i tried to title that video in a way that when people search you know disaster recovery and i put some keywords in there um, but I guess people don't find it. So this is a little qu quick short video today, which I am not famous for, that will help you restore your settings after you've upgraded and something may have gone wrong where uh, Windows had a problem and didn't save your settings and loaded all of the Lightburn default settings. So I hope this video helped you today and I... Uh, <laughs> I hope you enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed making it for you. And maybe it'll slow down the uh, comments on the groups. You know, I know I have a lot of followers 
and I know Lightburn has a lot of followers. They've already put out a video on it. Now I'm putting out a video on it. I'm sure some other people are going to put out a quick video on it, and hopefully it's going to help you to do things the right way. So as always, I want to thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. And making everything right, calling my name day and night, putting the signs of black, personalized and grand.